just now we'll discuss about the anatomy of hypothalamus part one first of all we'll make the diagram if you cut a coronal section of the cerebrum you will find there is this is corpus callosum this is insula this is here is this is corpus callosum this is septum pellucidum here is fornix this is fornix and here is caudate nucleus this is position of third ventricle this is third ventricle and here is lateral ventricle this is position of the caudate nucleus so this is third ventricle and here is position of this is diencephalon thalamus hypothalamus and here is position of lentiform nucleus this is lentiform nucleus and here is this is claustrum this is claustrum this position of the internal capsule this is coronary data this is internal capsule this is third ventricle this is third ventricle if you cut a midline section median section you will find if you see this part the section you will find This is corpus callosum. This is corpus callosum. This is corpus callosum. Here is anterior commissure. This is lamina terminalis. This is lamina terminalis. This part is lamina terminalis. And here, this is optic chiasma. This is optic chiasma. This is lamina terminalis. This is optic. Chiasma. This is tuber sinarium. And this is pituitary gland. Here is position of mammary body. This is stark or infundibulum. This is mammary body, and here is this is tegmentum of midbrain. This is pons, and here is medulla oblongata. And posterior side here is. This is pineal body. Here is hemorrhoid commissure. This is posterior commissure. This is superior. This is inferior colliculus. This is superior colliculus. This is inferior colliculus. This is cerebral aqueduct. 
and here is position out. Pornix. Yeah, this is Pornix. This is Pornix. Pornix. Here is interventricular foramen or foramen of Monroe. This is cerebral aqueduct. From here to here, this is hypothalamic sulcus. So this is hypothalamic sulcus. This part is thalamus. And this part is hypothalamus. Weight of hypothalamus is about 4 grams. The weight of this is about 4 grams. It is about 0.3% of weight of the brain. If you see here, boundary of the hypothalamus anteriorly, it is, you can see, this is, this is lamina terminalis, posteriorly, this part, this is tegmentum, inferiorly, optic chiasma, and this is tuber sinarium, this part is tuber sinarium, this is infundibulum, this is mammillary body, this is mammillary body. So, these structures from the inferior boundary, and superiorly, there is hypothalamic sulcus, this part from the superior boundary. So, these are the boundary. Here, you can see, medially, it is related with this. This is hypothalamus, this part. Medially is related with third ventricle and laterally there is internal capsule. So laterally there is internal capsule and medially third ventricle. So these are the boundaries of the hypothalamus. Thank you.